welcome. Today, we are going to practice English. Does that sound fun? Okay. I love to start every class with a song. Does that sound like good? Let's try it. Okay. First, let's remember the words. I say, you say, okay? Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Good. How are you? I'm good. I'm great. How about you? Good. Okay. Let's try again together. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm good. I'm great. How about you? Good, nice job. Okay, let's try another verse. Okay, so listen and repeat. Hello, hello. What's your name? Nice to meet you. Do you want to play? Good, excellent. Okay, now let's try it all together with some music. Are you ready? Okay, so remember, listen and repeat. Okay, let's try it. I go to school. I meet my friends. I meet my friends. And we all say. And we all say. Hello, hello. How are you? I'm good. I'm great. How about you? Good again. Job. Okay, let's try the next part. Remember, listen and repeat. Let's go. Every day, every day, I go and play. I go and play. I meet new friends. I meet new friends. And we all say. And we all say. to play? Good job! What a fun song! Wow! That was really, really good! I heard you singing and you sounded great! You sounded wonderful. Do you like to sing? I like to sing. Okay, now we said hello, we warmed up. Now let's try some reading. Yesterday we started 
with one of my favorite books. It's called The Cat in the Hat. Do you know this book? Ooh, let's see. Okay. Yesterday, we started with the cat and the hat. What did we see yesterday? We saw Sally and her brother inside their big red house. And what's the weather like? Is it sunny? No, it's not sunny. It's raining and everything is wet. If you were here yesterday, you remember this part. Sally and her brother were sitting at the window when they heard a bump and the cat in the hat came into their house. I know some good games we could play, said the cat. I know some new tricks, said the cat in the hat. A lot of good tricks. I will show them to you. Your mother will not mind at all if I do. Then Sally and I did not know what to say. Our mother was out of the house for the day. <gasps> hmm. But our fish said, no, no. Make that cat go away. Tell that cat in the hat you do not want to play. He should not be here. He should not be about. He should not be here when your mother is out. How is the fish feeling? Is the fish happy? No. The fish is angry. Let's see what happens next. Now, now, have no fear. Have no fear, said the cat. My tricks are not bad, said the cat in the hat. Why, we can have lots of good fun. If you wish, with a game that I call Up, Up, Up with the Fish. <gasps> Put me down, said the fish. This is no fun at all. Put me down, said the fish. I do not wish to fall. <gasps> oh my goodness. Have no fear, said the cat. I will not let you fall. I will hold you up high as I stand on a ball. With a book, one one hand, and a cup on my hat. But that is not all I can do, said the cat. Look at me, look at me now, said the cat. With a cup and a cake on the top of my hat. 
I can hold up two books. I can hold up the fish and a little toy ship and some milk on a dish. And look, I can hop up and down on the ball. But that is not all. Oh no, that is not all. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me now. It is fun to have fun, but you have to know how. I can hold up the cup and the milk and the cake. I can hold up these books and the fish on a rake. I can hold the toy ship and a little toy man. And look, with my tail, I can hold a red fan. I can fan with the fan as I hop on the ball. But that is not all. Oh no, that is not all. <gasps> wow, let's look at this cat. He is holding so many things. Let's see if we can find all of the things he's holding. A cup and a cake on the top of my hat. Hmm, I see a cup. I see a cake on top of the hat. So silly. I can hold up two books. Two, one, two, three, three books. I can hold up the fish and a little toy ship. Okay, fish and a little toy ship. Okay, what else? The toy ship and a little toy man. Okay, here's the toy ship. And here is the little toy man. With my tail, I can hold a red fan. Hmm. Oh, I see the tail. And I see the fan. Wow, look at all of these things. That's too much. Let's see what happens next. <gasps> that is what the cat said. Then he fell on his head. He came down with a bump from up there on the ball. And Sally and I, we saw all the things fall. Oh no! And our fish came down too. He fell into a pot. He said, do I like this? Oh no, I do not. This is not a good game said our fish as he lit. No, I do not like it. Not one little bit. Now, look what you did, said the fish to the cat. Now look at this house. Look at this. Look at that. You sank our toy ship. Sank it deep in the cake. You shook up our house, and you bent our new rake. You should not be here 
when our mother is not. You get out of this house, said the fish in the pot. Oh no, the fish, he is not happy. He is very, very angry at the cat in the hat. But I like to be here. Oh, I like it a lot, said the cat in the hat to the fish in the pot. I will not go away. I do not wish to go. And so, said the cat in the hat, so, 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 I will show you another good game that I know. Then he ran out, and then fast as a fox, the cat in the hat came back in with a box. A big red wood box. It was shut with a hook. Now, look at this trick, said the cat. Take a look. Then he got up on top with a tip of his hat. I call this game fun in a box, said the cat. In this box are two things I will show to you now. You will like these two things, said the cat with a bow. I will pick up the hook. You will see something new two things and I call them thing one and thing two. These things will not bite you. They want to have fun. Then whoosh, out of the box came thing two and thing one. And they ran to us fast. They said, How do you do? Would you like to shake hands with thing one and thing two? Oh no, what happens next? And Sally and I did not know what to do. So we had to shake hands with thing one and thing two. We shook their two hands, but our fish said, no, no, those things should not be in this house. Make them go. They should not be here when your mother is out. Put them out, put them out, said the fish in the pot. Have no fear, little fish, said the cat in the hat. These things are good things, and he gave them a pet. They are tame, oh so tame. They have come here to play. They will give you some fun on this wet, wet, wet day. Then Sally and I saw them run down the hall. We saw those two things bump their kites on the wall. Bump, thump, thump, bump, down the wall in the hall. Thing two and thing one, they ran up, they ran down on the string of one kite, we saw mother's new gown. Her gown with the dots that are pink, white, and red. We saw one kite bump 
on the head of her bed. Then those things ran about. What would she say? With big bumps, jumps and kicks, and with hops and big thumps, and all kinds of bad tricks. And I said, I do not like the way that they play. If mother could see this, oh, then our fish said, look, look. And our fish shook with fear. Your mother is on her way home. Do you hear? Oh, what will she do to us? What will she say? Oh, she will not like it to find us this way. Oh, no. Look. If you look out the window, can you see the mother coming home? Where is she? Here. I see her shoe. She's walking home. So do something fast, said the fish. Do you hear? I saw her. Your mother. Your mother is near. So as fast as you can, think of something to do. You will have to get rid of thing one and thing two. So as fast as I could, I went after my net. And I said, with my net, I can get them. I bet, I bet. With my net, I can get those things yet. Then I let down my net. It came down with a plop, and I had them at last. Those two things had to stop. Then I said to the cat, now you do as I say. You pack up those things, and you take them away. Oh, dear said the cat. You did not like our game. Oh dear, what a shame, what a shame, what a shame. Then he shut up the things in the box with the hook and the cat went away with a sad kind <coughs> of look. See, now he's sad. Poor cat. That is good, said the fish. He has gone away. Yes, but your mother will come. She will find this big mess. Do you see this big mess? Oh, no. Everything is on the floor. So messy. This mess is so big and so deep and so tall. We cannot pick it up. There is no way at all. And then, who was back in the house? Why the cat? Have no fear of this mess, said the cat in the hat. I always pick up all my playthings, and so I will show you another good trick that I know. Then we saw him pick up all the things that were down. He picked up the cake and the rake and the gown and the milk, and the strings, and the books, and the dish, and the fan, and the cup, and the ship, 
and the fish. And he put them away. And he said, that is that. And then he was gone with the tip of his hat. Then our mother came in, and she said to us too, Did you have any fun? Tell me, what did you do? And Sally and I did not know what to say. Should we tell her the things that went on there that day? Should we tell her about it? Now, what should we do? Well, what would you do if your mother asked you? Oh, wow, the end. What do you think? Did you like that story? I love that story. The cat in the hat is one of my favorite books. <coughs> the cat comes in, makes a big mess, but he cleans everything before mother gets home. Wow. Okay. Are you ready for something else? Yes? Okay. Good. Hmm. Maybe we can do some spelling. What do you think? Let's try. Let's try. Okay. Let's look at the picture. What is this? Hmm. Oh. Did you say cat? That's right. Very good. Okay. Can you help me to write cat? Let's start at the beginning. Cat. C cat. Hmm. C. Good job. Okay. K ka a hmm. What letter makes the a ah sound? A, that's right. Okay, one more. K a t t I heard you say it. Good job. How do you spell cat? C A T Cat. Good job. What sound does a cat make? Meow, meow. Good job. Okay. Let's look at the next picture. What is this? Hmm, when I'm really, really hot, I turn this on. Any guesses? It's a fan. Good job. How can we spell fan? Let's start at the beginning. Fan. F. F. Good job. Fa. Fa. I think this is another A. Okay, one more. Fan. What sound? Mm. That's an N. Good job. Fan. 
F A N. Nice going. Are you ready for the next picture? Okay, let's try it. Oh, what is this? This is something I wear on my head. This is a hat. Very good. Okay, hat. Hat. Ha, ha. H. Ha. Hat. A. T. T. Hmm. T. Excellent. Hat. H. A. T. Very nice. Hey, let's look. Picture one, we have cat. Picture three, we have hat. Cat, hat. Just like in our story. That's very funny. Good job spelling. Let's look at the next picture. Picture four. Hmm. What is this? Maybe I can put something inside. What is this? Um, it's a box. Of course. So how can I spell box? B. B. Hmm, is that a P? No, it's a B. Oh, okay. B. Ba. Box. B. O. What's the last letter? Box. Nice, good one. That's an X. We don't use the letter X in many words, but here we need it to spell box. B O X, box. Okay, good job. Let's look now at picture five. Oh, so cute. What is this cute little animal? It's a pig. I love pigs. What sound does a pig make? Do you know? It's a funny sound, isn't it? Good, let's spell pig. Let's start at the beginning. Pig. P, P, pig. P, nice job. Okay, what's next? P, 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 hmm. I. Excellent. Okay, one more letter. G. G. Of course, that's a G. Okay, we did it. We spelled pig. P. I. G. Pig, pig, pig. Okay. Let's look at picture number six. What is this? It's very, very pretty. 
Oh, I know. This is a place we usually find spiders. <gasps> Ooh, where does a spider live? In a web. Do you know this word? Web. Let's try to spell it. One, two, three. Hmm. W. W. I know that one. That's a W. Where? Where? Oh, right. That's an E. Okay. One more. Web. Web. B. Great job. Web. W. E. B. Nice job. The spider lives in the web. Oh, I think the spider's saying something. <gasps> Hello. Hi, spider. Okay. <gasps> oh, we have a nice, cute little one. What is this? Something very, very small that you see outside on the ground. What is this little, little thing? Oh, did you say bug? That's right. How can we spell bug? B, b. Just like box, b, b, box, b, b, bug. So, it starts with a B. Okay, what about the second letter? B, b, a, no, b, <gasps> u, of course. Okay, bug, bug, hmm. When we spelled pig, we used a G for the G sound. Let's try bug. Oh, right. So we have pig and we have bug. The G letter makes the sound g. Nice job. Oh, I think the bug is saying something. Hi. Hello, bug. Okay. Look at this next one. Hmm. What is this? Two people doing something together. What is this? It looks very nice. Oh, it's a hug. Oh, I love hugs. Hey, hug, bug, hug, bug. Hmm, they sound really, really close. Let's try spelling it. Huh, huh, huh. H. Good job. Okay. Huh, hug. Bug. Hug. B, U, G, H, <clears throat> U. G. 
Wow, look at that. We have two words that look and sound very close. Bug, hug. Good job. Okay, here's another picture. Oh, this is an easy one. I know what this is. This is the sun, of course. I see the sun every day. Sun. S hmm. You're right. Sun starts with an S. Sun. S. S. U. Okay, one more. Sun. Sun. Oh, that's right. That's an N. Good job. Okay. We have three more words. Can you help me finish? Please. Okay. Wow, what's this one? What number are we on? Let's look. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, comes next? Ten. Good. Okay. What is picture number ten? Oh, I know, I know. It's a dog. Of course. Look, it's a cute little dog. And he has a bone in his mouth. Let's spell dog. Dog. D, d. D, dog, da, o, hmm, okay, dog, oh, do you remember this sound? Bug, hug, dog. I think it's going to be the letter G again. Wow. So when we hear the sound G, like bug or hug or dog, we use the letter G. Excellent. Okay, number 11. What is this? It's pink, it's yellow, and white, and black, and I wear it when I go to school. It's a bag, of course. So that first sound Bag, B. Good job. Ba, ba. Oh, that's an A. Hey, look. What sound do we have again? Bag. You're right. It's another G. Wow. Bag. Dog. Two words with the G sound. Okay, we have one more. Picture number 12. 
This is something you usually find on the floor. And it's something that you walk on. What is it? It's a rug. So rug. Hmm. Rrr. Rrr. Oh, this is a hard one. Oh, did you say R? Let's try R. Yes, that looks great. Okay. R. R. Hey, that sound is just like hug, right? H. R. Let's try a U. And look, I can't believe it. We have the sound again. Rug. G. 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 Dog. Bag. Rug. Of course, it's another G. The G makes a G sound. Look at all of the G's we have. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wow. Six G's in all of those words. That was really good. Do you think that was easy or hard? Well, you did a really, really good job. I had so much fun with you today, learning and practicing English. Thank you for helping me read and thank you for helping me spell those great, great words. I hope you have a beautiful day and I will see you tomorrow. Can you wave goodbye? Wave. Goodbye. <laughs>